Another series, what should I name it? Let's be creative, Andrew. You can be creative, Andrew. Let's be creative, Andrew. Oh. I don't know, customer service apps. What about that? Hello and welcome to another Shopify app review video. My name is Andrew, your host and owner of ecomexperts.io and we specialize in Shopify development. So this week we are looking at a live chat apps. Uh, we did a whole bunch of series already on meta fields and reviews and marketing apps, but this week we're really looking at the chat aspect and what Shopify has to offer in its app store. Uh, and more specifically, like the title I already told you, we're looking at gorgeous today. Gorgeous? Gor gorgeous? Gorgeous? Gorgeous. isn't good enough for it. It has a 4.8 out of 5 star review out of about 200 reviews at this moment, if I'm correctly. And they have multiple plans. They have a $60 monthly plan. That's the lowest plan. And then it goes up to $750 for their enterprise plan. But okay, Andrew, enough talking. Let's look at the behind the scenes, how gorgeous gorgeous is. I had to make the pun. I'm just, I'll, I'll let myself out in this. The app is installed and integrated with our demo shop and here we are on the account creation window. Uh, usual things like name, email, phone number and password are right here. Um, let's set some easy to remember pass and click on the green button that says continue. On the next page, we need to confirm our website and help desk website. Let's change help desk website to ecom experts and gorgeous automatically adds .gorgeous.io extension to it. Um, we can live with that. So click on create your account. We are on the dashboard right. Dashboard is split into three parts. On the left, we have the menu as you can see. And if you click on the tickets in the top right corner, you can choose between tickets, customers, statistics, and settings. On the left, we have the progress bar. So we will start with that. Uh, first step, connect your Shopify has already been done. So then we get to the app settings tab and let's choose integrations in the menu on the left as it is our first step. Oh, didn't expect this. On this tab, you can choose between 17 integrations. Huh, let's start with the first one. So we click on email and we are on the new window. We already have one email, which we got for free from Gorgeous, but we will add our own email. So click on the email address and a new window appears. Three options are available. Google email account, Office 365 email account, and you can add your custom email. All right, let's go back to the integrations. And now we need to set up the actual live chat. So click on chat and we are on this new window right here. Click on the green button that says add chat and we are on the chat configuration tab. A lot of people complained about poor app design, but I can't really see that being a current issue. Maybe we will encounter it later, so we'll see. But for now, everything seems to be pretty okay. <laughs> The first step is to choose a chat title. Let's go with ecomexperts.io customer support. Gorgeous allows you to set different introduction text for businesses and out of the office hours. For the business hours, we will go with need help. We are here to help you. And for the out of office, maybe we can write something like, sorry, we're currently out of the office. I'm super original right here. Uh, the colors right here work with us, but if it doesn't fit your team, this is the place where you can kind of change it around. Also, a little bit disappointing is the fact that Gorgeous is available in only eight languages. Ay caramba! But we will stick with English and we will click on add new chat. For the installation of this live chat, you can choose between two options, auto install or manual. Uh, we will choose auto install and proceed to the preferences. On the preferences tab, you can set rules for email capture and autoresponders. We will set optional for email capture and for autoresponder, we will choose, thanks for reaching out, our team will get back to you shortly and save the changes. Gorgeous allows you to add campaigns to prompt visitors of your website to start chatting with your team and you can add quick replies. 
Let's go back to the integrations and see what else we can do in the tab. Next in line is the integration with Facebook Messenger and Instagram. So basically this integration creates a ticket when a customer posts something on your Facebook page or when a customer sends you a Messenger message. That's kind of cool. I didn't know this app could do this as well. So let's set that up. Click on the blue button in the right corner, give the necessary permission, and that's basically it. You can even import the last 30 days of history, post and comments as closed tickets just, you know, for days data purposes. For that, you click on the button right here and click on save changes. And that's basically it. Okay. So we are back to the integration step. And from here, we can also integrate any app with HTTP, Recharge, Smile, Help Docs, Vico, Swell, Amazon, Slack, Segment, Zapier, Hotspot, and Smooge. The integration step is done. <laughs> All right, so now that you know what it works together with, we can proceed to rules in the menu to the left. Rules provide a way to automatically perform actions on ticket, like tagging, assigning, and even responding. That's pretty nice. If you want to change the executing order, just drag and drop them however it suits you. And you can even make your own rules by clicking on this green button right here. All right, let's go to the next step, which is tags. So right here in the tag section, you can tag tickets to keep track of topics, customers are contacting you about. That's another great function. There are pre-made tags, but you can easily add your own by clicking on a create tag button right here. All right, guys, this app seems like it has unlimited functions. I'm going to be here all night recording this video, um, but we are on the satisfaction tab next. I expected it to be a rate our app, but no, Gorgeous allows you to send survey email after a ticket is closed. You can choose when to send an email after the ticket is closed close survey channel and text on the survey. This is an amazing app. All right, so that's finally pretty much it. I think we're only left with testing it. So let's jump to our demo shop. Uh, and then here we are on the shop and this is our live chat right here. Okay, guys, this app is great. First, I was like, why is this app so expensive? And now I totally see why. It has a whole bunch of useful functions. And frankly, they all work perfectly. The design, as some people said, might not be perfect, which people pointed out they would expect it for this price range. But with the minor improvements, this app would be one of our favorite apps. The statistic tabs offers enough details to run your store smoothly. And the import function is just a huge plus. All right, that was it for Gorgeous. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope it gave you some um, some insight on how the app functions. If you maybe need to get some upper approval, make sure to show them the video. Otherwise, um, if you need any development work, let us know, ecomexperts.io. We're there for you, Shopify, Shopify Plus. We got your back. And definitely, if you enjoyed this, make sure to check out all our other app videos because there are some gold mines in there. Make sure to like and to subscribe to show us that we're doing a good job or at least tell me in the comment, hey, Andrew, you're doing a shitty job. You suck. It's gonna break my heart, but all right, fair enough. I'll take the feedback. Anyway, thank you so much for watching this week and let's see you again in the next video next week.